sickle cell versus occlusive crisis it is a painful complication of sickle cell disease induced by obstruction of small blood vessels by crystallized sickle cells leading to ischemic injury to several organs including bone the bone pain is usually difficult to distinguish from acute osteomyelitis the causes are pyogenic infection malaria dehydration severe anemia stress and anxiety the symptoms are bone pain fever anemia uh, sickle cell anemia the signs are usually elicited are bone tenderness and fever investigations fbc esr crp sickling and hb electrophoresis if not previously known and also blood film or rapid diagnostic test for malaria parasites urinalysis and culture be creatinine blood culture and sensitivity uh, the main treatment objectives are to prevent the development of other skills or crisis to relieve pain to identify and manage the precipitating cause of crisis um, to maintain a good steady state hemoglobin to prevent long-term complications and organ damage and to manage um, sickle cell crisis and complications once developed non-pharmacological treatment to encourage adequate fluid intake and also good hydration at all times by drinking adequate water or fluids avoidance of common precipitating cri- um, causes of crisis such as malaria by the use of bed nets and dehydration stress excessive exercise and exposure to extremes of weather maintenance of good nutrition client education um, parental parental or guardian education genetic counseling with voluntary family size restriction and general public um, knowledge pharmacological treatment you treat malaria and other infections appropriately and also um, rehydration and um, analgesia too should be given appropriately referral criteria to refer all patients with complications to a pediatrician physician specialist or hematologist